Oh no. I mean, all that yelling. Y'all, hey. Feed them to the zombies. You got chopped that shit off. It has to be now. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Just cut off Damn. Bro. Bruh, my man ain't even. Yo ain't even measure it. Nigga left that nigga with an ass. Yo, yo ain't leave that nigga no ankle. <laughs> Gamer. What's going on, everybody? My name is Nod the Gamer. And I'm Bria. And welcome back to The Walking Dead. Last episode, we were in the pharmacy. We lost a couple soldiers. I got punched in the face, and now we're on the road again. That's, That's it. it. That's the <laughs> intro. <laughs> but before I jump into this episode, it'll help me out a lot. If you guys drop the like and subscribe, it helps us out a lot, and it lets me know that you guys are interested in this type of content. And without further ado, up, down, up, down. What's that dance? Lean. Up, down, up, Please. down. When it was in the Not party. The COVID. <laughs> <laughs> up there, the up there. Hey yo, look at that Okay, we got a little. I just did the recap, but you know, they're they gonna give are. it to us again. Oh, I got oh, a good one. You know, you said, you got punched. Yo, they taking us all the way back to the beginning. You've been all by yourself through this? My man talks so yeah. passionate. I want my parents to come home now. Yo was killing yeah. that. He knew he Keep was killing that, that shit in the door. booth. <laughs> Doug, you got it. And I'm Carly. Niggas okay, lost Carly, Doug. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't even done talking. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of those. Hey, yo, hot head. Kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Ready, I was about to say they was ready. Show that nigga going through the window. Oh my god. Oh I yeah, we at the motel. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Then Duck was talking Clem head off. Hey, yo. Like, wanna lay off a bit, Duck? Huh, Caesar. Damn, somebody chowing down. He looks fucking dirty. Lumberjack Lee. <laughs> Who the fuck is he? Who the fuck are you? What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <laughs> <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Yeah, a rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. Burr, where did Mark oh, even come right. from? No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Not enough. We'll manage. Actual we'll manage. Oh shit, my Maybe. Bad. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's gotta miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, bro. Kenny got to feed three Kenny people. And Lily fighting all the time. Things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a family. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him though. I mean, yeah. You Larry going off on him last night. What the fuck, Katja going to do? Anyway. Right. Seems and like duck, he's got dumb a problem with you in particular. Yeah. He's racist. He's just looking out for his dog. He's, he's an just an old racist, racist asshole. That's his deal. <laughs> well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Hard problems or not, we should all be out here trying to find food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. 
And didn't he punch you in the face one time? <laughs> yeah. Bro, how do you know? Off. You you wasn't even there. Right. She doesn't even go here. Do you even go to this school? Don't risk it, no. Mm -hmm. Fuck it. Take the shot. <laughs> you anything we can get at this point. I mean, he already aimed up at it. That's fucking gross. I would not survive. Bruh, I gave. Shit, was that Kenny? I gave I your dumb ass the green light and you missed. <laughs> Somebody about to fall. Shit, oh, Kenny leg here. I mean, Lee leg here. <laughs> Oh, wow. Some kids. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Where they get, get these it guns? Off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Can't All right, but up. your man's is done. Right. You gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. You gotta help. Me. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just okay. see if you can get him well. out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Yo, sound like a. <laughs> Not our problem. Gotta get him out of there. <laughs> oh God, thank you. See, he won our help. Hurry, please, hurry. Ew. All that damn yelling. There's no release latch. Oh no. I mean, all that yelling, y'all. Hey, feed them to the zombies. You got to chop that shit off. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Uh, please hurry. Uh, please do something. Please, that look. weak ass what throw. Please get me out of this. Try to get the guy. God damn it. Bro, God damn it. So hurry. Uh, Bro. Is he, is he gonna make it? Stop. I'm about to chop that nigga leg. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Lee, it has to be now. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Anything, Lee. Damn it, Lee, just cut off the fire. Damn! No have time for that. I'm sorry, but we have to go. Now! Bro, Bruh, my man ain't Lee even. Yo ain't even measure it. Can't keep him back forever. Nigga left that nigga with an ass cheek. Yo, yo ain't leave that nigga no ankle. <laughs> no type of shin. And then why is he just staying right there? You passed out. Damn. My man about to look up now here. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Oh my god. Damn, yo strong as hell. Right. Behind you! Travis! He gone. Come on, he come gone. On. We gotta move. He uh, gone. That nigga dumb. Why yeah. would you sit there? Oh, yeah, you gone, dummy. I mean he deserved it. You gone. Shut up! My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Uh, I'm talking. Good riddance. Fiend time. No! Hey. My nigga, you literally in the woods. You knew zombies was on top of you. He wasn't going to trust us anyway. Exactly. Like we Fuck him. This camp. We ball. With his old coot. When are you? When y'all gonna have a heart attack for good? It's like. <laughs> Aww. Hey yo, you know what kid bored as hell when they just do that shit against the wall.
They fortified the hell out that though. And her ass still kicking that shit against the damn. <laughs> Yo, that man is ugly. As hell. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God! What happened? Oh, oh, <laughs> Yo, ran right in the duck. Okay? Get him into the Wait, truck. Not I'll see what I can do. <laughs> okay. Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Why are you hey, just you talking to me? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What? No, sure. I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right yeah, well, now. We're about to lose one. Well, where did Mark well, come from? On we haven't even talked leg. to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, uh, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Welcome to the family, son. <laughs> yeah. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? <laughs> Just come you. on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, mm, but now that it's yeah. running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Damn. Hey, <laughs> and Bob that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Bro, I don't Why see don't your you old ass out there in the field cry. finding no food. You just d eating at this point. I can't stand his ass. You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. That say less. <laughs> That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Say less. You ain't getting no, nothing. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. Ben ain't you getting shit. He knew. Not Clem getting son. Clem Kenny. I got like four things. Your father ain't getting shit. <laughs> that nigga on the end of his days. Fuck that nigga. Why the apple ain't For brown? ten hungry people. First of look all, at my <laughs> hey. Ew, look how yo on the wall. Damn. Hey yo, don't get out to my face. Bruh. Nobody's eating. Bruh. It's about to be Clem, Kenny. You can pick the other two. I mean, if you're gonna be if I we say gonna, I call if we gonna be eating Kenny like that, then duck. You said, Doug, fuck Katja, she busy. How's it going, Katja? That's how it be. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? No. I'd better not. <laughs> <laughs> Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. All right, girl, keep working. I did the I right, did the right thing. thing. Yeah, I know you did. All right, then. The right shut it up. It's just scary sometimes, I guess. 
I ain't got no morphine, no nothing. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. I ain't do a damn thing. <laughs> Go ahead and check in on the others. Nigga just I wanted to vent. Here anyway. Nigga ready hand out food with them bloody ass hands. My man walking down disappointed. Yes. Oh, there go Clem. Oh, she going. It's How you fun, doing, everybody. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it. I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. So sweet. Nah, I'm gonna give her her food off the early. What you want? <laughs> More apple. It's good for you. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. What you think? Oh, give her an apple. It's half an apple. It's healthier. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. Damn, girl. <laughs> Be grateful. Let somebody else get some. Enjoy it. You deserve it. Listen, Clem out of everybody getting something. Then I said... <sighs> I ain't looking at duck. <laughs> Yo. Do I really want to get this little nigga something? <laughs> <laughs> Why is his eyes like that? Hey, duck. How about a little food? Oh, boy. Ew, he looked like a crack and cheese. Ew. Here. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry. That nigga look like he just goes zoom zoom zoom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who like next? He do a little anime. Bro. Cause this is Kenny right here. Fuck, 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 giving Kenny shit. He only care about duck. Mm. Give some to my boy. Who next? Well, you such a girlfriend. I call him. Look at yeah, your default girlfriend. Look at him. Want something to eat? Damn, hold up. I thought I had more. It said four, right? Unless what? I got two crackers and yeah, cheese? Yeah, you got two. Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm holding I'm okay. up. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. All right. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Okay, so do I still got the one? Okay, yeah, yeah on the side. Bad, say less. I don't feel bad now. Look how he bopping off. Look at this little bop. A little bouncy walk. <laughs> now play with the ball. At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. Shit, I might as well give uh give it to Kenny. Give it to Kenny and Mark. Fuck the other side. Did you take care Want of my son? Eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. He <laughs> starved. <laughs> Thanks. Nigga Ray, fuck You him. ain't think about his wife. You're about to demolish his guy. Right. <laughs> All he care about is duck. Damn. <laughs> Save it for yourself. I need to keep my stuff. <laughs> <laughs> <out. laughs> fuck them. I don't even know Muck. I need to keep my stream. I don't even know Muck. You gotta take care of them kids. You heard what Obama said. Not such an easy job, is it? It was real easy. <laughs> Fuck your father. Hey yo, please. Stiff neck ass boy. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. Yeah, of course. Still, <laughs> I guess some people aren't gonna be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? Hey, this you gotta left. treat people better. You keep treating people like you're this. You're big ass. Days in this you got enough shit to harvest. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Fuck you and Mark. <laughs> Alright, what the fuck we gotta do next? Talk to his bitch ass. Hey, you. <laughs> hey, is my friend gonna make it? Which one? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. It had to no be done. Way. How you holding up, kid? Uh, well, I, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you, you know? You could have warned your homeboy kind of, earlier. I don't know. Something. He'll be prepared, He'll be next, prepared time. next time. Next time? <laughs> yeah. 
So who are you people? Who's going to want to know? <laughs> I'm Ben. Ben Paul. The man you Bull saved got two Mr. first Parker, names. The band director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when... when everything happened. Hey, Ben. I hope you understand why I didn't give you any food. I'm new. I get it. It's fine, Lee, really. Relax. That nigga's stomach You're probably touching his back. To <laughs> yeah. I sure hope so. Alright, I talked to her already. Yeah. I don't give a fuck <laughs> to talk to Duck. Let's see what Clem, what else you guys say. Okay, artist. How's it going, Clem? How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? I think he'll be fine. Oh, that's good. I'm glad that they say Clem will remember you told her that. <laughs> right. And you reassured Clem. Will yep. you hold the damn board steady? <laughs> I'm Yo. trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. <laughs> Will you shut up quit being such a pansy? Yo, he really All right. I don't want none of that. Right. <laughs> Keep like, on going. You good, Mark? Right. You holding up okay, Lee? I, I was, was pretty saying, fucked up be back mad. there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah. I just hope Capture can save him. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! <laughs> She's Boy. making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. You gonna kick them out? Sorry, there's it people never mind in a business. Around. No, for real. I understand. Got to be hard to make those decisions. Just get me next time. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. You mind if we take it? Nah. Chop his yeah, fucking head off. For a bit. Boy, shut up. I'm gonna get that shit to Mark. I don't trust your big ass. Here, Mark, this should help. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Boy, nah. shut Come on, up. Man. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. <laughs> Yo. Damn. That's what you think this is? Is that what you told him? Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I don't care what it is. But you two have got to start trying to get away. Ain't no way. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Mm -hmm. Why the fuck Lee shake his head? Because he gonna say Man, being a racist is outdated. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of Kick this Kick his shit. ass over the fence. Ken, come back. There's nothing... <laughs> I'm sick of this shit, T. <laughs> Let him go, Captain. Let him go. What? He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. <laughs> I'm sick of this, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh! Yeah. Oh my gosh! Why he turned so fast? Told you, throw his ass over the fucking wall. The axe. Hurry. All right, nigga. Damn, your grandma shoulder. Oh, ah. oh, move, move. Damn. Mm -hmm. He's so Back dumb. up, dumb nigga. One leg. Hey yo, if you don't get that axe up, I damn concussion. <laughs> Shoot it. Hurry up! What you waiting on? Damn, that gun did that. Okay. Honestly, I told yeah. you so. Thanks. I told Why'd you. Why'd you bring him here in the first place? Boy, Asshole. Shut Hold down. Up. Hold down. You're gonna get us all killed. I can't Why wait for him. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? <laughs> what? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word. But he wasn't bitten. I swear. Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? 
Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? Hmm. It's not the bite that does it. <laughs> not cue in the music. Right. Nigga, nigga turn the damn no beat up. how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's going to happen to all of us. God, God help, help us. us. <laughs> God help us. <laughs> those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides. Everything so what the fuck is something in the air? When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Damn, she ate the whole team. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Shoot their ass. Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said Yo, they back look off. fucking crazy. You're outnumbered. You're outnumbered here. Let's turn around and go back. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if, if you could part with some extra gas before we leave. Boy, why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Look at him. <laughs> Our generators run on gas. Look. We own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? The oh, food. We got plenty at the dairy. <laughs> Lee, why don't you and Mark check Yo, that's the magic word, food. food. Right. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Yeah, I ain't got no guns. Y'all just out this... Just roaming. No deal. So, <laughs> I wonder what, what happen do? if you say no. I think we'll stay here. We're starting to develop a good vibe here at the motel. Good vibe? Well, Christ, Daddy O. <laughs> food supply and defenses didn't tickle your pretty pink ass. Bruh, my ass is black, first of all. Like a group. <laughs> this affects everyone. Y'all can go then. If everyone agrees, then we'll send you guys with some gas to check the place out. Hey, yo, if I said no, how you gonna send me? We'll stay in this wretched roach motel with your recreational paperweight over there. Plus, we stay close to Macon where we have access to the pharmacy for Dad. Kenny, Katja? We go. Come on, Dad? Kenny. You bet you, pumpkin. Carly? I said we go. So it was no fucking if they're offering choice. Food, we gotta at least check it out. What do you want to do, Clem? Clementine, what do you think? We, I'm very hungry. All right, that that's it right there. All right, looks like we're only going vote to that counts. Day. I only vote that counts. So Shit, this bitch, I leave y'all and go really by myself. Food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Not that old fuck. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Larry, Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? You know what happened. You know what happened. I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. So why Make are you sure bringing it up? Right, it. why are you threaten me with it? Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. Sweet. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? I don't even know Where you. Where are you from? I move around a lot. The motor ends my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? You can say that again. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor end. Uh, who's running things over there? Me, Why nigga. Are you asking all these questions. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. 
I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there, anyway? Bruh. Mm -mm. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's yeah, been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. And are. you guys were keeping it there's up There's only yourself. two. Oh, no. There's yeah, you know what? We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? <laughs> Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! Damn. Mm. <laughs> Boy, about to bring down all the zombies. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Bruh, it's not even zombies that you gotta worry about. Right. It's the motherfuckers with sense. <laughs> <laughs> that looks peaceful. Yeah. Here it is, St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? You betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Ew. Yo, that bitch look crazy. Who's that in the window? The kids. We've got kids in our group. Doesn't seem safe to have them near a lethal fence. Oh, don't worry about that. We got plenty to keep them entertained. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. Baby this here's Lee. He's been living down at the old motel, round the way. They got a few more friends staying at the old Bro, motel. Bro, is he sick? Oh my he goodness, gotta be bullet like he got the suds. <laughs> someone with survival experience to lead your group? I've got things no, under together. control. Plus we yeah, got I gotta keep it, gotta keep military it consistent. Experience. Well, sure. that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. Does that offer apply to the rest of us? We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. Alright now, Mark, you knew. How about this? Uh, calm your you horses. Go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry oh, souls. Yo, It'll all be of them nice look crazy. to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Yo, she off. literally got a pistol. Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Yo, bread doing something like this? Like coming back with steak. Mark, Lee, <laughs> why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. There this you place go. is incredible. It's got He food. is so dang on trust. Man, that Yo, fence. my man like Day Day on the first day of work. There's a damn security a guard. Stay. So how do you want to play this? 
Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Hmm. We've scraped together a good supply in the last few months. How about yourselves? What kind of protection do you have around here? We collected a few guns to protect ourselves, but we really only use them when we go off the property. When we're inside the perimeter, the fence is all we need. Bro, y'all ain't safe. even have guns just now. Right. Are we afraid we can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved Why on. Why would somebody Looking move for the on? People they lost contact with. Okay. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Niggas got the cornfields. Damn. Yo, they got hella land. Yeah. You're about to be like, so Mark, Mark, Mark don't go running your fucking mouth for here. Us to stay? Right. We can. It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? Right. As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just it popped out. I Please. mean, you did admit it right to his face. Cause you I mean, because you put me on a spot. He's that a piece guy's of shit. a piece of shitty. <laughs> <Look at his face. laughs> and then he going run and You're tell him. You're not things any better riling him up. True. Nigga, you started it this time. Right. There's one. Shit, y'all can keep Ugh. the arrow. Right, I was thinking that too. Look at his fucking Wait, fingers. It's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Disgusting. Come on, I'm sure there's still a few more. Hey yo, you'll say let's this push it up. Right. up. This place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, it well, it's that useless is? without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. Mm -hmm. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem <laughs> what decent do you mean enough. By that? I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes Please, down. I don't, got, I don't need your back, Kenny. There's <laughs> yeah. another one. I see it. Damn, that motherfucker was trying to climb. Ew, let go. Please. <laughs> Gross. Uh, Never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. I didn't even think of that. I know that shit got a stink. Hey, yeah. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. Alright. I don't even give a fuck. <laughs> just try to focus on the task. Didn't they Larry they just called you a pansy? Us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy yeah, off. Yeah, he's here. doing all the talking. From the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Bruh. 
bruh. Little help here, Lee? Holy fuck! What just happened? Boy, the way I would like dive what over that shit. <laughs> dive right the fuck here. over the zombie. Damn! What the Get to the gate! Yo, their aim is fucking impeccable. Yeah. On that gate is our only way out. You didn't deliver the goods. What did I do? Now we're gonna take what's new. Behind the track. Oh, it's probably locked. The the, the fucking brake. See if you can find the brake. Hold on. Oh, it's something stuck in the way. Give us the food. That down there, down there. Now push it. Why isn't it going? You probably got pushed a lever. Lee, get back here. We had a deal. Hey, yo. <laughs> if we can reach the gate. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah, shit. Watch your foot. <laughs> that nigga look crazy. Bro. Hey, yo, they yeah. dark as hell back there. What happened? Oh, yeah. Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down early. Nah, no, it ain't. That nigga ain't black. Hey, yo. Move his ass. I can't move him. You got it. I'm like. Yo, that nigga gone. Hey yo, please. Give us the food. Over there. Another one? That, How that many of those things crispy? They all black like that. Nah, they hell nah. Somebody alive. Shut up. Hey yo, you. shut up. <laughs> yo, stomping a mud hole in his face. <laughs> Throw his body. <laughs> the nigga you okay? his body. Yeah. You better walk. Come on. The gate's right there. Bro, walk. Look how Lee walking. Let's get out of here. Bruh, y'all did not have to kick that shit like that. So that shit can't go any further than that. That is so stupid. Boy, bye, cause you did that shit. Lee, what's wrong? Should I accuse him? The electric fence came on. Some people he was supposed to say that shit with more passion. We got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit, are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. That was after the fact. Sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama? Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. But God damn, it hurts. Hey y'all. Mark. Oh my God! What happened? He got Who shot told with him an arrow. Christ! Are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. And y'all wanted I to come here. Pull it out. Oh no, honey! Come on, Brenda's got you. Come mm. on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well. You must be the best. What kind of shit is this? <laughs> we ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Christ, maybe you were right about this place, Lee. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Hold up. So, so much, much for your understanding. understanding. So much for your deal. Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no <laughs> hey, way let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. 
bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Right. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Oh, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get Where the kids at? Who with the kids? Right. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with them. I hope they don't got Ben dumbass watching the kids. Well, oh, Ben and Carly there. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. They must be playing on that broken hey, swing uh, or something. Hey, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? Hey, yo. Uh, I love swings. I never see Just that. like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Nigga, yo doing the most. <laughs> Hey, Haley, found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right, provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around, and let me know if you find anything else. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. Well, I hope you're right. Yo, Duck they need and Clementine to hold that deserve damn a better life than starving to death <laughs> at some crappy motel. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. <laughs> Nigga, you shaking, ate. Cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'm not Yo. just talking about one meal, you know? I'm Bro. gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit. Nigga, camp. you like camp It'd be a good get opportunity a to find out a bit right. more about the St. John's yeah, I wish I could tell relationship him. with You can talk to, uh, talk, uh, talk to Clem. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Oh, that was her. Come on, now. Nigga can't just walk behind him. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. <laughs> How you holding up, Clem? How you holding up, Clementine? Aww. Hey, yo. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? You got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Then we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. <laughs> Ever since I met you, I've had good luck. Oh, so man. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do yeah, well, imagine a kid saying that. To how they were? Wait, what'd she say? Do you think things would be back the way it was? Yeah. I'm not sure when. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. All right, Clem. That's <laughs> you don't believe it. Save here. Okay. Hey, Thanks yo. Yo, me. keep skipping <laughs> options. Hey, yo. Yeah. Okay, duck. Don't pop a gasket. What you two bulls hoes doing? You saw the lips. Hey, How yo. you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. Mm -hmm. No shit. <laughs> you saw what they did to you, buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hey, yo, yo, I'm loving that shit. Who the fuck are these things? <laughs> we don't know. Yo. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. 
Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yo, my man about that action. Should I go with you talking? Go ahead. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Oh, Boy, hello, legs. Where are I going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Don't worry, baby. Ain't nobody talk about God. Oh well, Mama did. My prayers. See anything? Ew. Not yet. Get from behind me. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. Hey, a boy was eating Campbell's. Let's do coke. Oh shit, you found it? <laughs> Bro, what that even mean? You was a history teacher. Anybody? I see you. <laughs> Stay on your guard. Sounded like Medea. <laughs> Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Hey, yo, uh, boy, sound like Debo. I'm about to fade to black. Hey, yo. Camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Yo, my man talks so stern. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Get up there. Oh, it's a hot pot. Just water. They got that water cooking from while they at the store. <laughs> Come back. I'm trying to dump that goddamn food right in there. Empty. Big ass eyes. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Looks like they expected to be here a while. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Bro, they the type that bring the shopping cart back to the fucking <laughs> the complex. Ghetto. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Uh well, no. Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. I'll pass. <laughs> My man don't like jokes. Nigga, this y'all shit. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers mm -hmm. cross the line. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Nah. You good. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful. Hey, yo, uh, somebody trying to change the subject. Right. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. <laughs> Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Oh, boy, shut Oh. Y'all just be wanting shit to say. 
dang it. Thought I saw a Clem hat in that bitch. Yo, shorty look crazy. Down. Look at that. I ain't going back. Look at her Don't hair. Jolene ain't going back. Bitch hey, got main blowout. No shooting <laughs> yeah. as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had to deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Please, lie to Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Why are you alone up here? What happened to you? Well, that's a hell of a question, mister. They told me I'd be safe with them. Men who lived here. But it weren't safe. Not for me. And not for my girl. They didn't treat her nice. Not at all. They took her away into the woods. Wouldn't tell me where. And I begged them every way I could think. They just laughed. <laughs> so I killed them. And I'm staying here till she comes back to me. One way or another, she'll come back. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. <laughs> nice soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> you know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person Fuck I it. see. Enough. Y'all wave them guns like you're looking. Fuck it. Damn! Look at the back of her damn. <laughs> Shit! What the hell did you do that for? We had a deal with them. Justice. <laughs> <laughs> Justice. They've killed too many people. Jeez, whatever, Tex. I mean, I know she was crazy, but damn. <laughs> hey, yo, hey, yo, you the one that wanted to come out <laughs> here. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. It was either us or so, her. That's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go yes, tromping yes. through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. I wish you could've got that bunny for Clint. Come on. Damn, y'all ain't gonna take that bow? You regret shooting her? Fuck no. Why didn't you let her talk some more? I ain't know what, I ain't know what type of shit, shit she was on. It felt like she was about to rat on them though. Yeah. She was taking too long to get to the point. I ain't wanna get shot. Hang your balls right up on that tree. Niggas need them balls for Carly. Hey, <laughs> that was hell of a ride, huh? What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. Oh my god. You're back. What happened? Lee took care what of What happened? This Bro, isn't what Terry like Ursula. wanted. Terry. My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Girl, my business. Don't mind them. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Hey, yo, uh, well, say, it's say all probably that. just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. All right, we'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. 
I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. You keep saying that. That's just sounding more and more Don't untrue. Too far. <laughs> Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Look at that neck. He's very strong. I got lucky. Bro, why was she closing? <laughs> Here's your hat, Clem. Not him balling that shit up in his pocket. <laughs> we'll put that shit in his pocket. His pockets. <laughs> Hello. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Ew. Just kinda creepy, that's all. <laughs> Times like these, a 243 will keep you warmer at night than any lady I ever know. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait dead for time. supper then. It'll be a good one. Ew. Ew. <laughs> that nigga is ugh. It's not like someone from SpongeBob was it? Yeah, gonna Nigga, I'm about to turn this generator off. Send them down on us. Anything over there? What's in that box? I'll grab this for the fuck of it. I'm just gonna <laughs> borrow this for a second. <laughs> Nigga, it's a thief. I'm gonna I'm talk to Lily. Larry, I, I said Lily. Not your old ass. <laughs> Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? I shot one. We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy with a crossbow pointed right at my head. And then my so mom was kill her. Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Did you at least get some goddamn food? No. <laughs> you literally Nobody at a place with even food. Even talking it to was you. a mistake coming here. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? I mean, we you don't. Here, we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. Well, you stay here. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. <laughs> it's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm Damn, some kind of asshole. Flew. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. That don't make it right. I right. don't need therapy. Does he treat so you like he's that? he's the asshole. Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know All the that. time. But he's not a bad guy. Yes, he is. He just, he's got a lot of pain. Everybody do. He's been through so much and lost pretty much everything. Everybody has. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all Damn. just to protect himself. Please. And me. He's all he's hateful. got left in the world you is me. You enabling it. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. I mean, if he was gone, I don't him. think he would change. He's right. my dad, and I love him. Fuck you, you delusional. <laughs> <laughs> Why he walked me back over there? Did you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, I just told nothing. you. Yeah, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. 
These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Bro, I'm tired of your old ass. Right. I ain't even, I wasn't even talking to you. You found it too, huh? Wait, where did you come from? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor, what'd you have in mind? <laughs> Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Oh, and I got that little, uh... Oh, yeah. That thing. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, <laughs> right? Hey, yeah. No, why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying that. <laughs> hey, <laughs> yo. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hey, yo, I this love shit worse than Rush Hour. Racist ass. See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Can I help you boys find something? What's behind this door? <laughs> Fuck What's it. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. D don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Yo, right away, Doc. Andrew. <laughs> Keep him busy, Kenny. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Bro, Why so you, you ain't doing it? Just fucking stand there. Fuck you, Andy. What that mean, Dylan? Nigga got dinner. Mom, bro. Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! You'll spit. Okay, honey, let's get that. <laughs> Dinner time. Dad, Dad, come on, let's eat. Yeah. Kenny, come along, honey. No, you Kenny, spit come on. on the Don't make the booth. children wait. Yeah. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Not just dropping them. Yo, letting them bitches drop to the floor. Mm -hmm. Yo, let everything drop. Look at his little face. I love it. Don't know when the camera cut off, but we gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. Witnessed a lot of racist shit, even from my main man, Kenny. Come on, I'm urban. Hey, yo, my nigga Kenny belong here with these rednecks. No, that shit real. is outrageous. <laughs> <laughs> but no, we gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. Next time, we gonna see what's for dinner. You feel me? We think they cooking up something real nasty. Those ain't cows. You got one cow. But if you guys happen to enjoy this episode of The Walking Deer, you already know what to do. Drop a like, subscribe, hit that bell so that you know when the next episode comes out. In the meantime, check out this video right here. And like always, we shall see you guys in the next one.